We are really excited to be in Ames, Iowa. We have been here quite a few times and um, played, I feel like we've played Iowa State. I've been at Milwaukee a long time and we've seen Iowa State a lot and watched the um, progression of the program. So we are excited to be here in the NCAA tournament and, and ready to compete. Coach Thompson, you talked about your team this year and kind of what got you. Well, um, we had about we had a year of really pushing and working hard, and uh, we won our conference last year and had um, a bit of a spoiler semifinal loss in in the conference tournament where we were the number one seed. So, from that point forward, it really taught the returners how to you know the fact that it can be taken very quickly away, and so it really pushed the team to work harder in the weight room. Um, on and off the court, and uh, we've really, really um, made a made a push to become better. And I think this team has really taken that seriously. And so um, it shows, I believe, in the record that we've had this year and uh, how few losses we've had. So we're pretty excited about that. You guys do have kind of recent history with Iowa State. Um, talk about how you know them. And well, we know them in, in some different ways. I mean, one of their assistants is an alum, and another assistant in Joe, and um, he is an alum also, was on the club team at Milwaukee and coached for Milwaukee Sting Club for a long time, so we've always gotten a lot of those players. So um, there is familiarity, um, and Christy also another connection is she did coach my sister at Wisconsin, so there's, it's even, you know, it's crazy <laughs> how many connections there are. But I really respect the staff here, um, res respect the program, um, but we, yeah, we have had, we have played them quite a bit of times and, um, but you know, in some ways I think that's good for us to be familiar with the types of um, players they get in the um, type of offense they run the defense. So, um, yeah, we're excited about the opportunity. Let's think about, about Iowa State, what's kind of the big thing that they're going to have this year? Well, I think it's, you know, they're very well balanced in their offense and they have a lot of heat coming at you all the time. Their little barrel's really good. Their defense is strong. So there's not a lot of weakness in, in their game. Uh, so we are, you know, prepared to have, you know, a tough match ahead of us. But um, so, you know, I don't know how else how to say it. <laughs> you, you embrace, embrace the, you know, obviously the underdogs in this match. Right. Do you talk about that? Yeah, we haven't talked about it a lot. Um, we haven't been an underdog in a while in, in this season because we have been the team we were picked first and we got, got first and so in our league. So, um, but honestly, um, this team is really on a mission to, to win um, every time we play to earn the win. They're very focused, they're ready to compete. So I'm not real worried about, you know, is our team gonna compete? Are they gonna be scared? I don't, I don't see that coming at all. Um, so, you know, I think they're ready for the challenge. He was not. He, he wasn't. Okay. He, wasn't. he was a club player, and then and he could. I mean, he could have been before I came. I mean, okay. this is my fifteenth yeah. year, so I mean, I knew Joe when he went to the Milwaukee Sting Club. So he could he could have been at some okay. point a volunteer or something. But he wasn't. He was never on your staff. No. Mm -mm. Okay. Curious. How did that last year kind of affect you guys? I think as a team. We've learned from that loss. I mean, we went in there thinking that, oh, we're awesome. Like, we're just, just going to happen. Yeah. But, like, after that loss, like, it kind of sunk in. Like, it's not just going to happen. We have to do the work. And, like, we took things for granted then. And this year, we didn't let that happen. So. You played against Iowa State in the past. Is there anything you remember about those matches? Um, I remember losing, but I also remember winning my freshman year. So I keep thinking about how it's possible. Like, we can win. And so. <laughs> well, you just talked about the, um, you know, are you, are you relieved to be here? Is it, I mean, you guys have a lot of people working for this. You talked about the mm -hmm. so. We're really excited to be here, um, especially with having a history with Iowa State. I think they're fierce competitors, but so are we, and we're not, we come into this and we're, our heads are so high, we're not disappointed, we're excited about the task at hand, and it's a great opportunity for us for future programs as well as right now, the present. What did you think of the college draw? Um, I was a little shocked just because, well, in my four years here, we've gone to Illinois every time, 
So, um, but more teams from our region have gotten in this year than the past. So, um, it's different, which is exciting. But uh, I mean, same thing. We're really excited to be here. We have great history. We have won and lost against Iowa State. So, um, we're just excited to play. I think it's been a long time coming, especially with the loss last year. I think we're ready. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, we took that match out. <laughs> <laughs> we were kind of laughing at what the lineup was, and you know, it's hard yeah. to remember because you move on from match to match and year to year. So, and they came to us; they were on our court. Just being senior, uh, both your senior, I think it's exciting because. It's just something that every person dreams about. You grow up through club, you grow up watching these girls play, and then you're finally here, and it's kind of surreal once you get here, and then you have like the media and you know certain times for everything. It's just, you can't ask for anything better, and having this amazing of a senior year is everything that you could ever imagine, going undefeated in conference, clearly sweeping the conference tournament, and just getting here like with the thought that we could win, like we're going to win, I think is just, you can't ask for a better senior year than what we've had so far. I think it's an, like, an awesome opportunity. I mean, I've been there, you've been there twice before, and my redshirt freshman year, I've learned some things like before going in conference tournaments, so I took those things and we pushed ourselves, and like being here for the third time is just kind of exciting. It's our senior year, and we just wanted to work hard and push ourselves to the finals. When you go from you know, you obviously won your league, but now you're playing the number four overall seed. What changes with the opponent that you have to kind of deal with that? Let us do this. Well, I think um, a big component is our conference is very good at defense. Um, lots of really good liberals, lots of good defenders. What changes at this level is the net play. And we, you know, I haven't had experience eight other times as a coach in the NCAA tournament with tough seeds. Um, you really see that changing. And, and this team we have now, this, this year, we're physical. We're much more physical than we've been in the past. So I think that right there gives us a little more confidence in that area because really it is the jump, the higher jump, the harder hit maybe, um, you know, those sorts of things. But the defense is kind of what we're used to. Morgan has a liberal kind of maybe a different type of him. I think going into these matches with higher competitive, higher, like bigger jumpers, harder swingers, I think as a libero it's really fun. It's something you look forward to. Um, you kind of get the opportunity to kind of like prove yourself. Because in our conference we have great liberos. Um, so coming out here you get to prove that you can compete with the big dogs and stuff like that, being a smaller player and what, if you want to say a smaller conference. But it's something that we get to look forward to. And we have a great staff that was able to prepare us for this. So. Um, I'm really looking forward to getting out there and just competing and working hard to dig balls that you know you wouldn't think you'd be able to. So. Are you I think we talked about all year is taking risks. Like the only way we're gonna win is if you go for it and you come out of your comfort zone and take shots or serve harder, the only way you're going to win is if you take those risks. If you play easy, 